Seven Point Weather 12 forecast. Well, we've got dry skies in the forecast for today and tomorrow. Less humid conditions as well. It's a beautiful morning. In fact, from our East Providence camera, if you remember yesterday morning, last few mornings, we were sucked in with the fog and the low clouds. So nice to be able to show off those clear blue skies out there this morning to start your day. It's 56 degrees winds from the west at about nine miles per hour. Gusty winds definitely part of the weather story for today, but a pleasant one overall, both today and tomorrow. We do have a better shot of seeing some showers on Thursday. Latest data coming in looking at a little bit of an unsettled day, mostly cloudy, cooler in the 60s, setting us up then for a warm weekend. Temperatures are going to soar. A little bit of a summer sizzler, especially on Saturday. Right now it's refreshing outside. The dew, dew points are dropping. The humidity is lower. Temperatures are in the middle 50s for most of the area, including 56 in New Bedford, Newport and Willimantic. Mid 50s in Providence with those west winds again around 5 to 15 miles per hour. They do pick up. Check out these winds today. 15 to 20 miles per hour gusting 25 to 35. So it is going to be a breezy day, but a pleasant one with still above average highs. We're going to head to the middle 70s with with sun giving way to partly cloudy skies. Here's an hour by hour look at the forecast. So I expect us to be in the lower to middle 60s at the end of the morning commute. By lunchtime, low to mid 70s, about 74 Attleboro, 73 in Coventry, and close to 70 along the coastline. So more of a land breeze today. So even our shoreline community should crack 70 degrees. About 75 in Providence this afternoon, 76 in Attleboro and Taunton, and then falling back into the 60s early this evening. This is 7 o'clock, 69 degrees in the capital city. Dry skies for the evening hours and dry at our beaches. Sunny and a bit windy with the surf 3 to 5 feet. Low rip, current risk, safe sun time this time of year. Only about 15 to 20 minutes. So new this morning, small craft advisory issued for the bay. Not a surprise with the sort of winds that we're forecasting, gusting to 25 knots with the waves around 2 to 4 feet. Our plans to be out and about this evening. It's looking really nice. 70 degrees still at 6 o'clock in the evening. Skies will be clearing and the temperatures will cool. So by 11, upper 50s. And then late tonight, noticeably chillier night, upper 40s to low 50s. Nice night for sleeping. Let that fresh air in. We've got a drier stretch of air with this cold front that's already come through, brought those showers and thunderstorms late yesterday evening. Second push of dry air going to be coming in here with a cold front, some scattered showers up across northern New England. But we're expecting it to stay dry here Wednesday. Sunshine to start with some increasing clouds at the end of the day. Showers over the Midwest Wednesday afternoon will push into New England on Thursday. They look scattered and light, but could be enough to bring about some indoor activities or some cancellations. You've got outdoor plans for Thursday. Friday's highs much warmer after 60s on Thursday. We're close to 80 Friday afternoon and should be well into the 80s on Saturday with that hot and humid weather. Low to middle 80s up in the upper part of the bay and some upper 80s well inland coastline on Saturday about 70 to 75 degrees for the second half of the weekend. Still warm humid with the chance for a thunderstorm as a cold front approaches Sunday evening and night.